Welcome back, folks. If you're just joining in, we're riding the Buffalo Mountain Trail System located in historic Mate 1, West Virginia. One of the really neat things about riding the Hatfield-McCoy uh, trail systems here in southern West Virginia is the uh, coal mines and the coal mining history. Uh, behind us here we've ran up on an old mine and uh, Jeff, uh, why don't you tell me about the mining industry and didn't that kind of lay out some of the roads for the trail system? Absolutely, Stephen. The mining industry was the uh, core development in southern West Virginia. That's why we have these roads and it's actually the mining industry and the land ownership patterns in southern West Virginia that make the Hatfield-McCoy trails possible. Coal companies came in, they bought uh, hundreds of thousands of acres of real estate. That's the real estate we use today to develop our trail system on, and this is just one of the many remnants they've left behind of an industrial age that's uh, long since left southern West Virginia. Cool. We're going to roll on down the mountain here. You were telling me that one of the mines is still actually burning? Yeah, we're going to go see one of the mines that the coal seam is still burning. Uh, the gas is still coming up out of the ground, so I've been burning for 50 or 60 years. Uh, it's a site that a lot of our riders stop and look at, and it's a little piece of West Virginia history. Wow, folks, let's get out on the trail and go check that out. <laughs>